Okay, welcome back. Uh, playing Throne War Mini, which is similar uh, to these War for Throne games. It's obviously on a smaller scale. We're playing a faster time control. Uh, one three is what we're doing. And and what? Uh, yeah, so it's faster. It's not as many pieces on the board. The name of the game here is to conserve material. Um, control of the center is good. I think it plays less of a role in the early game. It more it might be more of just a deterrent in the early game. But uh, you'll notice here, um, you know, each player only has eight eight pieces. So if you have one in the center, that's one fewer that you have to defend to attack. Um, early promotions are good. Trades are bad. Um, yeah, so yellow's playing smart, doesn't want to trade. I wouldn't want to trade either. I'm going to, I'm going to back off here. Maybe I'm losing a tempo because red's just going to go here anyway. Uh, but I don't think speed is as crucial here in the beginning of the game. So we'll see. Uh, green is weakening yellow. That's good, seeing as yellow is the other high-rated player on the on the table. Um, promotions are good. Uh, I'm gonna back off again. Maybe I'm losing in tempo. Maybe it's all right. It's okay. I'm. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'd rather play solid than be the first to promote all my pawns. Promotions are good. Time is also good. But having more material on the board, I think, is, is better. So yeah, yellow continues, or sorry, red continues to just push pieces into the center. That's okay by me. We're down to five pieces on the outside to defend once he goes in, which I get the feeling he will. There we go. Promoting is good. All right. Now, I'm the only player here with zero points. That's something that I should probably keep in mind as we get closer to an end game. We'll see. We'll see if that uh, matters too much. So green's probably going to get beaten up here with a double attack. Eh, I guess not. Although that is a strong positional move by yellow. Not sure if I would have seen that. Not that it matters. All right, so now we're fully promoted. We've got eight kings on the board. We're looking good heading into this end game. Um, no real threats. Green might go down on time. Just uh, kind of chalk it up to inexperience. Or maybe green gets mated by yellow. I can see very easily one, two, three. Yellow would have to give up two kings for it. Nah, now that option is not on the table because one, two green recaptures there. Um, okay, so now maybe is the time to start moving in against red. Um, yellow is adding some tension here, knowing full well that I'm going to be distracted. I think I'll just back off, tell yellow you know what, if you want that square for your king, you can have it. Red can't promote. Actually, red can't do anything but move the king. Now I can take there. Uh, that was not a smart move. Here would have been better. Um... Okay, red is almost in stalemate, if not for those two uh, those two kings. 
Green takes here. I have mate. Um, here is OK. Again, it's not snail mate because red can move around in the middle. But this will be uh, checkmate. I'm fairly certain. Uh, well, let's see. I like this. Yellow has to move in here to prevent mate. Now green moves, and I get to checkmate, and I can claim the win. So, good game there. We'll play again. We'll see. Uh, we'll see how the second game pans out. And we're playing again. It looks like the same three opponents. So we're back for round two. Let's see how things shape up here. I feel, I feel good about that last game. Um, played solidly, had some good opportunities. I was thinking tactically. Um, took, took a couple checkmates when I had the opportunity to. Um, I go here because there's a possibility Red could go here next, um, and I wouldn't want to make that promotion if Red had a king there. Again, avoiding the trade. Probably going to promote. We'll see. If Red goes here, I might back off. Yeah, I think now might be an opportunity to do that. Although, I'm thinking of a double attack. Let's go for it. I'm not sure if green will see it. Yeah, so green does see it. Well played. Um, I bet red's going to recapture here, though. Oh, hey, how about that? That's cool. Um, maybe. Maybe I go for the center. I don't think it's a super useful move in the beginning of the game, but if I have the opportunity, why not? Especially when red is now down to five. I have a feeling that very soon uh, these won't be an issue, and I'll be able to move to the center. Uh, this promotion is probably a wasted move. Maybe I'll back off. I'd like to, to take out some of red, Red's pieces, but I have to be very careful here. Uh, especially when Yellow still has all eight on the board, although Yellow seems to not want to promote for some reason. I think this might be a good move just because Yellow is signaling that he doesn't want... He wants to keep eight pieces on the board. Huh, so much for that. Okay, either way, it's three points for me. I'll take it. Uh, promote here, maybe? No. Okay, so now I'm thinking promote... Uh, I'm thinking of promoting on my own. We'll see if I get the opportunity. Here, I would want to uh, capture. So promote. Can I do this, or is red going to? OK, I can do this. I was going to say, I don't want red to get too comfortable in this, in this corner. OK, so it seems like everybody's just playing kind of a shuffling game here. Um, I'm going to do this. I can't really retreat the king. But if I'm giving the opportunity to, I will retreat on the next move. Again, so much for that idea. Okay. I see this. Uh, that's against the rules of uh, four-player chess. I mean, it's kind of a gray area, but you could say that he is uh, signaling an intention or attempting to influence gameplay. 
in attempting to influence other players' decision making, which is not allowed. Um, yeah, it's kind of unfortunate, but uh, it happens. All right, and now we're getting to the, that point where I was saying red won't be able to put up too much of a resistance if I want to take a walk with my king. Um, I'm thinking probably here I always have the opportunity to support that king. Yeah, I'd rather him here closer to home than on the other side. Yellow doesn't quite know what he's doing. Making up his mind. Again, it's a faster time control, so uh, you know, not too much opportunity to sit around and wait for other players to make up their mind, but here we are. Wait it out. I'm expecting a move like this from Green. Green probably sees what's happening and doesn't want to come in last place, so we'll most likely attack red, go for a mate, okay, maybe not. Here would be a blunder because of check, check, check. All right, um, let's do this first. As soon as I step out with my king, everyone is going to realize what's going on. Maybe right now yellow doesn't see it or doesn't care. And I'm being given some, some latitude here. Red knows he's done. Green will probably, you know, if it was me, I'd be going for mate on red. I don't want to. I don't want to lose this game. Don't want to come in last place. So, uh, checkmate on red would all but guarantee second place. Now here, I could get hit with check and an attack there, or in the opposite order. Green would move in. Red would go with a check, and I'd be in trouble. So. Maybe I think about doing this and hope that red doesn't do anything about it. Okay, that answers that question. Now I now red doesn't have that check available, so that's good. Looks like we have got our second win here. Maybe we'll see this from green. Okay. Um, now I'm going to do something here that maybe you're sitting there watching this and you'll think, what is going on? Uh, I'm going to give second place to green. If I went into the middle right now, green would get third place. Green is a higher rated player. Um, I would much rather give points to higher rated players than let lower rated players get second second place. So with that, I will take first place. All right. So anyway, uh, that's all I've got for today. Thanks so very much for watching. Um, of course, as always, um, chess.com is the, is the four-player chess server that I'm playing on. Feel free to join me there. I'd love to uh, get some more competition. All right. Thanks for watching, guys.